Hey guys, welcome to vtechacademy.com. And here in this presentation, we are going to solve few examples on equal functions. So first, let us learn the definition of equal functions and then solve few examples. So here, two functions f and g are defined on the same domain D are said to be equal if f of x is equal to g of x for all x belongs to D. So here we have the example as f of x is equal to x plus 2 divided by x square minus 4 and g of x is equal to 1 by x minus 2. Then we have to prove f of x is equal to g of x. So first let us consider the given function f of x is equal to x plus 2 divided by x square minus 4. We can write here x square minus 4 as x square minus 2 square. And here if we observe this is in the form of the formula a square minus b square which is equal to a plus b into a minus b. And by comparing we get the value of a as x and b as 2. Now let us write x square minus 2 square in the form of formula we get here x plus 2 divided by x plus 2 into x minus 2. So here we can cancel over x plus 2 in the numerator and denominator and we get the value of f of x as 1 by x minus 2. And the given function here g of x is also equal to 1 by x minus 2. And here we observe that both the functions are equal. By this we can conclude that f of x is equal to g of x. So here we have the second example as let f is a function from r1 to the r defined by the f of x is equal to x plus 1 and g is a function from r1 to r defined by g of x is equal to x square minus 1 divided by x minus 1 then let us prove f of x is equal to g of x. So first let us consider the function g of x is equal to x square minus 1 divided by x minus 1. So here we observe that x square minus 1 is in the form of the formula a square minus b square which is equal to a plus b into a minus b. So by comparing here we get the value of a as x and b as 1. So let us write here x square minus 1 in the form of formula we get x plus 1 into x minus 1 divided by x minus 1. Here we can cancel over x minus 1 in the numerator and denominator and we get the value of the function g of x as x plus 1. And the function f of x is given as x plus 1. And here we observe that both the functions are equal. Therefore, we can conclude that f of x is equal to g of x. So this was a basic introduction on how to solve examples on equal functions. Hope you understood the concept. Do like and subscribe to vtchacademy.com. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.